The Boeing 737. Max's engines were too big to fit, so Boeing had to shove them higher and further forward on the wing. The 737's design dates back to the 1960s when jets had smaller, slimmer engines. Fast forward to the Max, and it needed the giant CFM Leap 1B, nearly one and three quarters meters in diameter. Problem. The 737 sits low to the ground, leaving almost no clearance. To make it work, Boeing lifted the engines up and nudged them forward on the wing. It was a clever fix to avoid redesigning the landing gear, but it subtly changed the jet's aerodynamics, especially how it behaved at high angles of attack. That shift meant the nose tended to pitch up more aggressively. To keep the handling feel consistent with older 737s, Boeing introduced MCAS, the Maneuvering Characteristics Augmentation System. And that decision sparked one of the biggest debates in modern aviation. It's a reminder of how even small design compromises can ripple through an aircraft's behavior. A few inches of engine placement transformed the aerodynamics of a jet flown by thousands of pilots worldwide. So, here's the question. Was moving the engines a smart engineering shortcut, or the design flaw that defined the MAX?